peace. We're cooling with the completest man. We're in Springfield, Massachusetts, and I'm about to hit up Hobbies, Games, and Comics. It's in Springfield, Massachusetts, man. Let's get it. Here it is. Bob's Hobbies and Collectibles. We're about to head in. Hey, how you doing? <laughs> and said this one. And I said this one. Here. Here. Mm-hmm. This one. All right. Can I get um the bendable action figures of Batman, the Superman joints? Yeah, they got a lot of collectibles in here. Heli runs, a bunch of omnibuses and compendiums. That was mine. I'm good. Now hitting the most excellent comics and game. Oh, this is beautiful. <laughs> this is beautiful. Oh, yeah, I like this. Peace, peace. You cooling with the completest, and I am in Springfield, Massachusetts. Made one of my good stops at Most Excellent Comics and Gaming. And I definitely want y'all to tune in because I have, um, we're just going to have a discussion. And if anything, y'all can come through to Springfield, Massachusetts and come to the place and check it out for yourself. Great. And if you want to see visuals of the place, you can go to YouTube at the completest. They actually don't work here. Oh, okay. I just hang out. Oh, so you hang out here. Yep, okay, got um, you, got you. I retired, and being here gets me out of the chair at home. Understood. It gives me something to do. And so how long would you say you've been reading comics? I've been reading comics since I was probably your kid's age. Ha! <laughs> and just so everyone knows, he is a little bit older than me, but looking good, though, looking good still. Not but... me. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> so... You say you love comics, and I do too, man. So have you been um, caught up to any of the recent runs or new updates of certain superheroes or certain com comic book companies like Immortal Hulk, for example? I don't read Immortal Hulk. I know it's very popular. Mm -hmm. But I read Crossover. Okay. I love that. Got you. Uh, Walt Simonson's Ragnarok, <laughs> which is really, I got to say, it's, it's his... Um, it's better than the Marvel Thor. We love the Marvel Thor because that's what we grew up with. Right. But Ragnarok is Thor again. And it's Simonson's love of that Norse mythology. Mm -hmm. And it's what he's doing on his own. Gotcha. without Without the corporate oversight. Understood. And that's funny. I actually seen that issue and I haven't read it. But now that you told me that, I'm definitely gonna have to get on, get on that, and I'm um, I'm a big myth head myself, so that is one of the reasons why I love Thor, um, the whole you know um, storyline for him as well, because I love the mythology behind it. So I can definitely understand that. But, well, yeah, him Simonson working on his own mythology. Well, well, the mythology and his own and his words. Own. Yeah, got you. Is is fabulous. Got you. So how long have you, so you said that you just be hanging out here. So how long would you say you've been just hanging out here? How long has this store been around? This store has actually been around 20 years or so. Mm. They, uh, they started in Springfield, a couple of different locations as they moved around and grew bigger. Mm -hmm. Then they moved down here in Enfield. They were gotcha. in the mall for a little while. Okay. And they were down the street. And they were in the other end of this plaza, and they grew into this. Now is this beautiful scenery that we see here. Yes, sir. I love the process, man. I love it. In fact, they're getting ready to open a second location down in Manchester. Oh, anyone that's in Manchester, they open in a new location. So you heard it here yourself. That I listen. I'm happy to be here, man. I. I work so much, but I, like I said, I'm a comic collector, so I finally got a chance to get out and, you know, just travel and just look around, man, because I see, because where I live at, there really isn't a lot of comic book shops, so a lot of my comics that I have in my collection, I ordered them, 
or I had them already for years. Yep. You know what I mean? So it's hard, and it's hard, and it kind of hurts, you know, not being able to go into a comic book shop when you want. Because I, I used to, when I was a kid, um, I lived there in Cleveland, Northeast Ohio. I live in Cleveland, so d downtown Cleveland to be exact. But I used to live like in the east side by like um, Lake County. In Lake County, they had a lot, they have a lot of comic book shops. So I used to go there a lot, buy my video games there, my comic book issues, posters, things of that nature. But then I moved, and now I, it seems like I just got to go every once in a while. You know what I mean? So I do. seeing that there are comic book shops like this just in the neighborhoods of certain places makes me jealous. <laughs> I can understand that. <laughs> Definitely, man. But um, either way, thank you, man, for your time, bro. I really appreciate it, man. It was my pleasure. Man. This is what I do. I, I, I come in here and I talk to people about comics and... And, and I just, I help out when I can and where I can, but. Definitely, man. When, if you get a chance, I don't know if you that savvy on tech and the internet, but if you get on YouTube, you can subscribe, go to my podcast, you can call in, and we can have a definite, we could talk again. We could talk about more issues. We could even talk about crossover, you know. Crossover was very good. Yeah, I'm going to read it now. Just because you told me that, I'm going to read it tonight, matter of fact. Well, so. I'll tell you what, crossover, crossover is nice because it, they imagine that this is the real world. Mm -hmm. And all of a sudden, in the middle of the United States, a bubble pops up with all of the comic book characters and their summer event mm -hmm. and how that affects the real world. And when they say crossover, they mean it. Mm -hmm. He went and got permission from X, Y, and Z, yeah. and they've got Madman, and they've got the paybacks mm -hmm. from uh, Dark Horse. Right. And... I mean, there are just there are characters from almost every genre of comic books that you can imagine that are making appearances. Mm -hmm. Man, that sounds crazy. It is. I, and it's a lot of fun. See, y'all heard it here. So if y'all haven't listened, I mean, sorry, if y'all haven't read Crossover, definitely go and do that now. I'm going to do that tonight. And what's your name again, sir? Mike. Mike, man. Thank you, man. Um, my name is Jordan. This is... Um, it's, this is amazing, man. All right, I'm about to get out of here, y'all. I'm about to go and do some shopping real fast. But thank y'all for listening in. This is Cooling with the Completest. Peace. Have a good one. Love yourself and love your family. Good day.